Now to the damage from the CCU Lightning Complex fire, significant at Big Basin Redwood State Park. It ripped through that park. Historic buildings burnt to the ground. Redwoods left with burn scars. Action News 8 reporter Christopher Salas went on a tour of that park today. He has more on why park rangers say you won't be able to visit for quite a while. Good evening, Dan Aaron. One of the reasons why the park is going to remain closed for that long is because while the fire is gone, the danger remains. For example, trees falling like this giant redwood that snapped at its trunk and then look at the length of this tree that fell down here. The CZU Lightning Complex burned through California's oldest state park, taking all of its historic structures with it. But still standing as majestic as ever, the heart of the park, the ancient redwoods. Redwood trees are amazing in terms of their ability to both resist impact and their ability to be resilient after the impact. Joanne Kerbavas is an environmental scientist with California State Parks. So what percentage of these redwoods ultimately will survive despite having burn scars? We don't know for sure, but based on at least one study, 88% of the redwoods survived. And I really expect something like that similar here. Some of the park's most famous trees, the mother and father of the forest and the hollow auto tree, all considered healthy. Kerbava said in order to fully heal, the trees need time. As much as we all want to welcome visitors back to Big Basin, we hope that people will understand that it is really for the health of this system that we allow it to rest. The fire is considered the worst in the park's history with climate change and a lack of forest management and prescribed burns as major factors. Many of the choices that we've made in the past have fed into um, the catastrophic nature of many of these fires. Sam Hodder is the CEO of Save the Redwoods League. He said his organization has plots of redwoods in the park. They're now going to study in the aftermath of this fire to develop more fire resistant forest policies. There is a lot we can learn. Allowing the park considered the home for conservation to once again lead the way. Our hope and our vision is that Big Basin becomes once again a pioneer for the park system laying forth a path that is different and responsive to the needs of today. And at this point, there still is no estimate on just how extensive the damage is. Survey teams have not been able to go into some of the more dangerous areas. Reporting from Big Basin State Park, I'm Christopher Salas, KSBW Action News 8.